And come hail, rain or shine, world-renowned photographer Spencer Tunick intends to fill one of Melbourne's most famous streets with naked people. In 2010, he photographed thousands of bare behinds on the steps of the Sydney Opera House. This July, he'll be filling Chapel Street with nudes. So he's put the call out for punters who are keen to strip off. Any shape, any size, any nationality, any ethnicity is welcome to participate. And uh, 18 and above, 99 and younger. There's a, basically a, a bunch of dicks out and about. It's another oh. day on Chapel Street, really. <laughs> Did he say July? Yeah. Very cold. It's cold in yeah. July. Why does he always choose cold places? Why I know. What's, what's the story? Well, he did, he did an uh, in, installation overseas where he painted like 3,000 people nude in, in blue. Oh, yeah, that's right. So he yeah. won't need the paint in Melbourne in July. <laughs> <laughs> it's <laughs> ironic that a man organising a nude festival is named after two items of clothing, Spencer Tunic. <laughs> oh. So maybe, he's fully clothed and they're naked. Maybe that's the joke. It's if just you do is it, that his Pete, actual name? If you well, do it. What, 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 if you do it, I'll buy ten more beanies. <laughs> what is it? Yeah, but oh, you know, oh, more, more than that. More than that. Big offer. Fifty beanies. Big, big offer. <laughs> <laughs> but, 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 there's no point. Tommy Little's already down there. Yeah. Sixty <laughs> beanies. Why are you so desperate to see me nude Stephen Price? Ask yourself that. <laughs> hey, uh, moving on quickly.